The Far Cry 5 Platinum is a very highly requested video on our channel. I've had more requests than I've had hot dinners. Oh god, yes! We've done a lot of Far Cry games on this channel, so if you do enjoy this, please make sure to check out those videos too. Let's get into this Platinum. The remote community of Hope County in Montana has been taken over by the radical cult led by Joseph Seed and his siblings. The US Marshal Service issues an arrest warrant for Joseph Seed. After a quick arrest and bringing him to their helicopter, one of Joseph's followers brings it down, jumping directly into the rotors and crashing the helicopter. Cultists quickly arrive, rescuing Joseph and kidnapping the sheriff and two other officers. We manage to escape on foot and get rescued by Dutch, a survivalist living on his own island in the center of Hope County. He explains there are three regions of Hope County we'll have to take in order to bring down Joseph. We start with John Seed, one of Joseph's brothers, then move on to Faith, his sister, and ending with Jacob, his older brother. This is also where we create an appearance for our character. Well, considering we're in the south, we've got to go with a big mullet. Not to mention my hair's getting long, so... Not too far off myself. Trying to make him look as much like me as I can right now. <laughs> we get our first trophy for liberating Dutch's Island, and then purchasing a thousand dollars worth of clothing. But before we continue, are you sick of the boredom that comes with grinding out thousands of collectibles for trophies? Ah, oh, not more collectibles. What can I do to make this less boring? Then why not try Raid Shadow Legends? And they've just premiered an animated limited series called Raid Call of the Arbiter. It's everything fans have been crying out for. More backstory, lore, and a glimpse into the wider world of the game. You can find this brand new series in-game for free! With episode one out now, and new episodes out every Thursday at 10 a.m. Eastern until July 20th. That's a lot of episodes. I've watched the series so far, and I've got to say, it is brilliant. Outstanding music, phenomenal visuals, and a real emotional connection to the story so far. And it's only been one episode. This is a way the world of Raid has never been shown before, releasing lore videos and behind the scenes content. Everyone will get the chance to get Artak, one of the five new characters from this new series. To unlock this legendary champion for free, just log into Raid for seven days between now and July 24th. Easy. But Lewis, I don't have a Raid account. It's no problem though. Use our link in the description below or use our QR code to get insane bonuses. We're talking about Epic Knight Champion Errant from the Banner Lords faction. So now you know what to do guys, let's get back to the video and get back to those trophies. The first mission of note was to retrieve the Widowmaker, a crazy colored truck with Gatling guns strapped to the front. This mission was hella fun. Holy mama, look at this thing. Ram through the roadblocks. Bam. Oh, this is so good. This is so good. Look at this, destroying. Holy moly. Oh, trophy, road gunner. While driving or leaning out of vehicle to kill 25 enemies. <laughs> I've already got that one. When you at the start of the game. We take a quick detour from the story to smash out all the multiplayer trophies with fellow trophy hunter Platinum Rob. Huge thanks to him here as these trophies are a pain in the ass. First trophy here for 100 enemy kills in arcade multiplayer. We get arcade competitor to win 10 featured maps in multiplayer. Arcade hero to play the arcade hero mode five times. Play three quests with a friend for hitting it off. Arcade enthusiast for completing 10 featured maps. And arcade player for reaching level 20. What a faff. Within each section, doing activities will make you a target for the head of that region. In this case, John Seed. He sends out a hunting party to capture you, and this goes for Faith and Jacob later. These occur three times before the boss is revealed. Air travel is a big part of Far Cry 5. Nick is an ally, and he wants you to retrieve his plane. As a reward, get a trophy. Ooh, we got the trophy, a wing and a prayer. Fly Nick's plane, hopefully you're not afraid of heights. Taken by John for the second time, we manage to escape his silo where Hudson is held captive, and we get ourselves a trophy for being deemed the sin of wrath. Of course, it wouldn't be a Far Cry game without a few bugs and glitches. Um, what's happened here? I think he's frozen. <laughs> Take down into glitch. We swiftly get the What Now trophy for completing three side missions. Following clues to end three treasure hunts grants us the Scavenger trophy, and managing to get 25 takedown kills grants us the Close and Personal trophy. In all Far Cry games, you have to liberate outposts. Far Cry 5 is no different. The only exception is you only need five for the trophy. We take our fifth, and that starts the John Seed final mission. Oi, Copperhead Rail Yard liberated. 
and get the trophy for it as well. Liberator, liberate five locations from the project at Eden's Gate. Woo. And we got a trophy for it. Kicking the Hornet's Nest. Trigger the Wrath of a Herald. That is John Seed as the Herald. Uh-oh. John Seed's mission starts off with him holding some nearby allies hostage. It eventually all goes to pop and we end up mulching down a number of his men. John then takes to the skies and we follow him. Shooting down pilot John Seed is all that's needed before he tries to escape on foot and then we eventually gun him down. Don't forget to loot him. After killing John Seed, we're off to go rescue Deputy Hudson inside Seed's underground silo. All the siblings have these as bases and they're filled with a load of guards. We find Deputy Hudson and escape the silo, completing the first of the three regions. Now on to more light-hearted trophies, driving Nick's pregnant wife across the beaten dirt roads to the midwife, and then helping Larry the scientist out with an experiment. Hit the button on the generator and send him off. Oh god. Did I just vaporize him? I think I did. Yeah. Put aside skepticism and help Larry. <laughs> I think I just vaporized him. Alright, if we buy this scope and this silencer. Locked and loaded. That is all attachments for one weapon. So if we line up the headshot. Oh, ghost kill. We got it. Second try. Perform a headshot kill with a bow or rifle on a cultist more than 150 meters away. Whew. Oh. <laughs> Squash and run. Run over 20. Run over and kill 20 enemies. That was a good one right there. The next herald we deal with is Faith. We're captured again as we're exposed to the Bliss, a drug used by the Seed family to convert you by force and enlarge their following. Converts under the influence are referred to as angels. We get exposed to the bliss and earn our first faith trophy. Oh, for f Extra crafty for crafting 25 recipes, followed by unlocking Peaches, a cougar who slots straight into your roster. One of the main missions in this region was to destroy a water treatment pump station. This was a great mission as it showed the dangers of the bliss drug airborne. After gunning down all the angels and members of Faith's forces, we finished the mission for the sewer rat trophy. Sabotaging vehicles to kill five enemies grants us the explosive surprise trophy in the same mission. Ah, stock garage, buy an attractor for another trophy. And we get the buy three vehicles trophy. Throw rock. Oh, opportunity Nox trophy for throwing the rocks. That's the distract distraction one. Distract 15 enemies. Normally get that towards the end of the game for me. Second time we're taken by Faith, we're having to rescue the Marshal as the Bliss has taken him. Another progress into the story. Ignorance is Bliss. Why are you on the table? Why are you on the table, mate? And we did get Blissful. Save the Marshal from the Bliss. So both times you get taken by faith, you get two trophies. That's nice. Come on. Come on, just die. Yes! I got it, I got it, I got it. Ignoble beasts. Kill a bison using only melee weapons. God for that. And like all Far Cry games, the Like a Bird 5000 meter wingsuit trophy is back again. Followed by speaking to 50 citizens around Hope County. This grants us the Ain't No Wallflower trophy. What's happening here? <laughs> I'm gonna punish that bull. I'm gonna punish that bull for humping that cow. Yeah! <laughs> Where's the beef? Tenderize a bull with your bare hands to death. With the Marshal bewitched by the Bliss, Faith puts an end to him and another ally. This leads us to the mission, The Lesson. We need to confront Faith once and for all. We end up in the Blissful Garden, entering the gate to see Faith in a dark Lady Galadriel form. Joseph made her like this, made her into a druggie basically. We got her, we got her, we got her, we got her. Kill Faith seed. Puff of blood smoke. With Faith now dead, it's the same as John Seed's mission. Head into the boss's silo and rescue the hostage they have. 
This time it's Sheriff Whitehorse we rescue. Found him. Found him. Sheriff Whitehorse. Oh, don't be doing that now, Sheriff. No, 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 no. Sir. We can still save you. Yeah. 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 Yes. Woohoo! Sheriff survived. Sheriff survived. Didn't hang himself, thank God. That would have been too gross for this, uh, this game right now. Saving Sheriff Whitehorse. That's for completing faith, I assume. With no time to lose, we're into the third and final region. This time, it's another one of Joseph's brothers, Jacob. Jacob is a military hardened soldier that uses the bliss to convert wolves and men into his own weapons. Jacob sends hunting parties again in the set of three, but this time it's to run a brainwashing assault course, in which the third time has an ally as the final target. Advanced warfare. Only you, Trophy. Successfully complete the first trial. The capture party from Jacob, the first trial anyway. Add two. There it is, survivalist. That is purchased half of all the perks available. Upgrading cheeseburger did it. Boom! The Herc Logger. Yes, Herc. Truly bond with Herc by destroying 15 vehicles together. I mean, it's point of name. Easy peasy. Our next trophy is completing Clutch Nixon's races. We always have racing in Far Cry. Here we go. Clutch Nixon in Jacob's area. Dun, dun, dun. Every Far Cry has the races. It's not a Far Cry without these races. Do it. Clutch Nixon! The quad bikes are so bad. They're so bad. Oh, come on. Come on. They're so bad to control. They go everywhere. They go absolutely everywhere. Woo, blind jump. Woo, we did it. Yes, yes. There it is. The greatest SOB that ever lived. Laughing dangers faced by executing a clutch Nixon stunt in every region. There's only three. So, so if I destroy this wolf beacon, I will get a trophy for it. Just nuke everyone down. There, troublemaker. There's my trophy. Discover the joys of destroying cult property in every region. And a whiskey case. Take. Pack rat. We got it. That is collecting one of every kind of collectible. Pack rat. The final mission in the third region is finally against oldest brother Jacob. Jacob recaptures you, makes you run the assault course for the third time, killing an ally for the final target. We escape the brainwash and go on a mad rampage up the mountain, to which Jacob has turned himself into a sniper from saving Private Ryan. No Woo! Eat it! it Eat it! Jacob down! In his dying words, Jacob explains that his brother might be mad, but he's not wrong about all the biblical prophecies. Upon his death, we enter the third secret super duper silo to rescue the third hostage, Deputy Pratt, and upon which completing the third and final region. Seeing as I've just killed all of his siblings, Joseph C. calls us to where the game started, his church. We journey to the center of Hope County to find him in a passive aggressive state, leaving us with two choices. Take our friends and leave, or, is it worth or resist. Taking your friends and leaving actually shows a secret ending, so to progress, you have to resist. When you do, Joseph becomes enraged, knocking over barrels of the bliss everywhere, and leaving you to recapture the minds of all your allies, until the point of Joseph becoming vulnerable. Neutralize. We got him. Neutralize the father. That's upsetting to get rid of Joseph now. Just killed his entire family. Now him. I'm so sorry, sir. You just wanted to pray. Joseph doesn't resist the arrest, but before all is well, a giant mushroom cloud appears in the background. It is the collapse, the prophecy of which Joseph speaks all through the game. We shove Joseph and the gang into a car and rush for the bunker on Dutch's little island. Before we reach the end, a horrific car crash. From there, the Together Forever trophy pops for reaching the end. The one person escaping the car crash seemingly unharmed, you guessed it, Joseph. We then awake handcuffed with Joseph standing ready to talk to us about the death of his siblings, while standing over the dead body of Dutch. Brutal. With this scene, the story of Far Cry 5 is over, but we've still got a fair few trophies to go, so let's go get them. 
All right, let's buy some cars. What should we get? What should we get? Let's get this one. And this one. Big spender. That's what we we're after. Spend $50,000 in vehicle shops. Done. Destroying 10 planes whilst in an aerial vehicle gets us the ace killer trophy. Just park some planes up and shoot them. Okay, there is four vehicles underneath my plane. If I just drop a bomb now. Death from above. That is disabling four vehicles at once with a plane. Back it up. Oh, fertilizing the land. You pop them like a balloon. Easy peasy. Using a tractor to obliterate five enemies. The Reaper tractor does it again. Getting all four fishing rods grants us the Hope County Master Angler Trophy. Popped at a really random time for me. Followed by the Been There Done That Trophy for completing all fishing and hunting challenges. And now, if we go into our sell loot, we can sell all the fish. For the final trophy, fish market to sell 20 fish. Bring it on, come on, come on. And we always had faith in you, platinum trophy. Victory. A massive thank you to our new patrons and everyone that supports this channel. We hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you in the next one. Cheers all.